Ilan sa kanila ay biktima ng panlilinlang ng rebeldeng grupo. Ang kampanya ng pamalan sa pangigayat ng mga rebeldeng grupo. Keeping up with its threefold mission of effective dissemination of government programs and projects, counter-propaganda of communist terrorist group, and public engagement and policy support, the Region 9 Strategic Communication Cluster of Regional Task Force to End Local Communist Armed Conflict began the first quarter of 2020 with fresh concepts and strategies that enlivened the excitement and gained the momentum to meet and put into perspective all the gains of 2019 and draw from there the inspiration to pursue its mandate. In its efforts to disseminate government programs, the cluster continues to use both the traditional and new media platform in the conduct of information and awareness activities. National Intelligence Coordinating Agency, or NICA-9, also produced compelling messages in social cards, code cards, and infographics that deeply strike at the core of the communist terrorist deceptive approach. Recognizing the vulnerability of the youth for recruits, the collaboration of efforts especially of the Technical Working Group for Youth Engagement is seen as significant accomplishment of the strategic communication for the month of February and early part of March. As a result, the team conducted an integrated approach in organizing i-volunteers or information volunteers among students of selected universities and colleges in Zamboanga City. Ang i-volunteers is a, an effective uh, program, uh, social intervention, ng PIA being the chairman of the strategic communication cluster and the national task force to end local communist armed conflict because uh, we need to communicate to the people to all sectors of society therefore the I volunteer is a catalyst of information campaign information awareness to address most of the problems or issues in the society by capacitating and empowering particularly the youth or the students as communicators, as government communicators, as information communicators, advocacy. Kasi dito po tayo natatalo ng kalaban. So we need to strengthen our information campaign, our awareness, our engagement, particularly the student sector. Kasi dito po ang recruitment ng kabila. The, se the student sector is the most vulnerable sector in our society insofar as recruitment of the CPP in PE in DF. And I believe that this is the most effective uh, formula that we need to adapt in order to, to engage, to inform the public of what is going on. And the I volunteer is a vehicle. It is a catalyst of information drive in order to strengthen our relationship with the public. Ang ginagawa po natin dito is to inform the students so that they will know, they will be actively involved in our advocacy for peace. The conduct of LCAC IVN orientation include an awareness session on terrorism and violent extremism after which student leaders resolve to organize themselves as volunteers and take an active part in the campaign to end communist terrorism. Through this program, we believe that uh, mas makakatulong to through um, further awareness na din po since um, kami na din makakatulong sa mga sarili namin. So as I a volunteer and as a youth also, I can be a role model to them and uh, gamitin natin ng maayos yung mga available resources natin to spread correct information and to encourage the youth in the right pathway, ma'am. So leading them into the right pathway through I volunteers To sustain the gains, government agencies and local government units are relentless in their efforts to pour more programs and projects that would benefit the communities that are highly susceptible to communist terrorist influence. These are the efforts of the DNR, DTI, DOLE, NHA, NCIP, CHR, and DILG to name a few who share their report. With this health crisis that impedes the momentum of Stratcom 9 cluster, agencies and local government units have to adjust and recalibrate their programs in order to help the most vulnerable and affected households and communities in the region. Amidst this new challenge, Stratcom 9 will be relentless and will remain committed to engage the public to firmly stand against all forms of terrorism and violence in their communities and keep the youth and every household safe and empowered.